everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today's video is going to be a cleaning motivation for you guys. If you're new to our channel, my name is Taylor and my sister Ariel and I post weekly videos of cleaning motivation and cooking and recipes for you guys. So definitely go hit that red subscribe button right now so that you do not miss any of these videos. And I did film this video after our 4th of July celebrations, so there was a lot of things that needed to be picked up on this day and just a lot of tidying and cleaning that I wanted to get done. And I always like to start by just picking everything up before I actually start deep cleaning. And I like to start in the living room. I always start in the living room. It just seems to make more sense to me. And then I move into the kitchen and the following rooms after that. from outside we always put everything down here on this table or the piano or down next to the door so I'm working on cleaning all of that up and getting it put away where it goes. I'm just going to do a quick dusting of everything to get all the dust off. We do live on a dirt road so we get a lot of dust and we typically have to dust every week or it gets really bad so I'm just giving a quick dusting before I move on to the vacuuming. And I have mentioned before in my previous videos that I love this feather duster. It makes dusting very simple, especially if you have a lot of breakables like we have here on the shelves and our piano. It just makes it so much faster to dust everything off without actually having to pick up each item. <laughs> is done I'm moving on by vacuuming all of the floors and I do love this vacuum I've mentioned it in a previous video 
but it does hard floors and carpet, so I really, really like it. It also has an attachment to vacuum off furniture or get in small cracks which is very handy and it's a nice all-in-one vacuum and I will try and link that below for you guys. I would definitely not move all of the furniture and vacuum underneath them but today I wanted to do a deep cleaning and I will try and do this either at the beginning of every week or at least monthly if I can't do it every week I'll just move all of the furniture off of this rug and vacuum underneath it. Also I wanted to move this rug over because as you can see it is not touching both couches and I wanted it to touch both couches so that it would just bring everything together and make it feel like it actually fit in there. So I did want to move all of the furniture off and just scoot it over closer to this second couch. can see everything that was underneath that couch. It definitely needed to be scooted back and vacuumed. rug would have been much easier if I would have had someone to help but since I was doing it myself I just basically moved off all of the furniture as you can see here and then scooched it over as best as I could and then moved the furniture back on top of it. And before moving the rug over I just wanted to briefly vacuum under this second couch that we have here so that it would be all nice and clean underneath there before I moved the rug over. wanted it to go I'm just moving all of the furniture back on top of it and I do like it much better this way I had been meaning to do this for a long time but it just not been getting around to it and it obviously looks much better and just brings all of the furniture and the living room together I'm just 
course, moving on with vacuuming in the rest of the front room, here in the dining room. <laughs> And now that all of the floors had been vacuumed and all of the front room picked up, I'm moving on into this front bathroom that we have here. And I just wanted to give it a good clean. We typically like to clean them really good on Mondays and then just give them a quick clean on Fridays. But here I am giving it more of a deep clean so that it's all nice and clean. I always like to start with cleaning out the inside of the toilet and I just let everything sit in there while I do the rest of the outside of the toilet just so that it can clean the inside really, really well and have it sit on there for just a few minutes before rinsing it all down. And I'm just using disinfectant wipes here on all of this. I just find that that's far more easy than using like a spray and paper towels. It just makes it so much faster for me and I really like using the wipes. <laughs> piece as well. everything like that. to clean today was just this front door. It seems like it gets dirty so fast and I feel like I'm constantly needing to clean it. So I wanted to give that a good clean and mark that off of my to-do list. <laughs> wipe 
down the whole door, not just the glass part, because it seems to get very dirty. We do have a dog in the house who jumps up on the glass, but also on this bottom white part that you see. And since it's white, it shows up those spots there very easily, so I like to just give it a nice clean. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already because we have some very exciting recipes to share with you in our very next video that you won't want to miss. So definitely hit that red subscribe button right now and we will see you in our next video. So be thankful and rejoice in the Lord. Bye guys. Trust in God through